Hi guys, this will be a short video about the importance of seals in air guns. This is the IZH 46M target pistol. It's supposed to shoot pellets at about 500 feet per second. I just got this one and when I got it, it was shooting between 250 and 300 feet per second. This breech has two seals, that one there and that one right there. And when I got this pistol, it was missing that seal. That's a wee teeny seal that looks like this. When I replaced the seal, the pistol went from 300 to 475 feet per second. Here's a brake barrel rifle. This one is a Diana Model 27. And when you break the barrel open, it has a breech seal right here. This one's a synthetic seal. When you close this barrel, that seal keeps the air moving from the compression chamber into the breech and behind the pellet. And it works like a champ unless the seal is old and flattened like this one. When the seals get hard, you can lose as much as 100 feet per second out of a 500 foot per second air gun. And here is the strangest one of all. This is a Crossman 105 multi-pump pneumatic air pistol. I've owned this for about 25 years and it hasn't worked in all that time. Before I owned it, I have no idea how long it hadn't worked. But what I did was I used a little bit of transmission stop leak with an eyedropper right there. Couple of drops. And it went from a non-working gun to a working gun, just like that. That is the importance of seals in air guns.